So we have an update on the Simona Halep situation. Of course, has been provisionally suspended almost a year now. Back in October last year was when she first found out that she had had a banned substance in her body. But we actually have some encouraging news. She's actually started her hearing for the case and to plead her case that she is not guilty as she's been pleading for the best part of 12 months. Now, it was before Wimbledon that we actually heard that she was getting tried and getting a hearing finally for this. And she's had multiple postponements of her hearing. She was supposed to get a hearing back in January. That got postponed. It was supposed to happen in like April. That got postponed. So she's finally getting the chance. And they say it's going to take a couple of weeks to go through all the information and then also get a result so hopefully in the next week or so we'll get a result. But also encouraging signs. She's actually playing on hard courts or training on hard courts as well, ready for the US Open Series. Now, she does have a lot of ranking points on the line. She's gone from number six in the world when she won in Canada nearly 12 months ago to now number 55 in the world. So she ideally would love to defend that title and get this out of the way as quickly as possible so she can get back on court and play that tournament and at least get some points from that. She probably won't win it back to back, but you never know. I mean, she has been training a lot in the off season and she has been getting her body right. So you never know what she's going to look like when she comes back. But she has so many points there. 900 points of her 1,000 point ranking uh, is in that one tournament. So she's eventually going to drop out of the top 100 if she doesn't get to play that or if she doesn't do well there. So that's going to be a big risk. Of course, the US Open, she's on the entry list, which is really good signs. We did see her on entry list throughout the season, uh, but of course, I couldn't play. I had to withdraw from those events uh, due to the provisional suspension. But let me know down in the comments below, do you think we're going to see Simona Halep at the US Open? Or do you think we're not going to see her until maybe the start of next year? Maybe all of this, I mean, who knows what she's going to happen if she doesn't get tr uh, her hearing done by the start of the US Open? Will she be able to actually play any events because she will be unranked? Will they get her wild cards to some of the Asian swing tournaments? Or do you reckon she'll just start at the start of next year if she does get found not guilty? She is, you know, in her 30s too, so she doesn't have that much time to be able to play. You know, that's the bad thing about having this suspension is that, you know, 12 months of her career is gone. Uh, more so if she does get found guilty. When I mean, she gets found guilty, she'll be probably gone for a couple more years. But let me know down in the comments below. When do you think we're going to see Hella back? Do you reckon it's going to be this year if she gets found not guilty? Or do you reckon it'll be more likely to start next year?